Hey guys, it's Plum and welcome to a brand new video. These are some sims that I made for the Horse Ranch expansion pack. I am going to be making a let's play out of this. I don't know if it's going to be long. It depends actually if I like it or if it's hard to do because basically I'm just going to be playing with the aspirations that came with the Horse Ranch pack. So I think it's going to be kind of a limited series, but it I guess it depends on how much I'm gonna enjoy it. But surprisingly, like I've been like from what I've seen so far, I feel like I'm gonna enjoy it actually. Like I know I said before that I'm not really like a horse girl. Like I haven't been interested in the pack until I downloaded it and saw other people play with it so now i'm kind of seeing the hype for it like i'm kind of liking it so far i mean i know a lot of people are still saying that it doesn't deserve to be an expansion pack but um i kind of see it now I mean, I don't want to speak too soon. Like, I haven't played it myself yet, but so far I'm really enjoying it, especially the cast part. I'm probably not going to do a speed build for this because, I don't know, I've just, I just haven't been in a building mood recently. I've just been loving cast recently for some reason. Like, I just have been enjoying this so much, which leads me to kind of like a channel update. I think I'm going to upload more shorts soon just to kind of fulfill my commitment of uploading every day again. I know I keep saying like I want to go back to uploading every day again and I don't know, maybe shorts are the way to do that. I know not a lot of people like shorts, but I don't know. It's just something that I kind of want to tick off every day because I've been building a lot of sims for my own personal enjoyment enjoyment recently so i just thought you know why not share that with the world and sort of post shorts for that anyway going back to the sims that you sort of see me making this first one is actually a dad so this is a pair of two sims so this is going to be a dad a single dad and a daughter um their names are frank and tori tori's mom passed away when she was younger but um her mom was a champion writer so she wants to become that as well so that that's her aspiration and frank on the other hand is a nectar maker and he wants to become an expert nectar maker so that is his aspiration so basically i thought of like getting two sims just so we could get through like both aspirations at the same time i don't know how hard it will be i've never actually played with a sims 3 ranch pack I, I don't even know what it's called but i think it was said that um in the sims 3 you can actually also make nectar i haven't tried that before so i don't know how hard it will be but i'm excited to explore that in this pack but i'm most excited to do the championship writer thing i don't know if it's gonna be like a black hole type of thing but hopefully it isn't at least for the training part i, th I think i saw some people like train their horses and stuff and i'm super excited to do that and as for the horse um i didn't really make a horse in cast just because i kind of wanted to experience the whole like like adopting a horse or maybe purchasing a horse although it doesn't really make sense for their storyline but we're just gonna ignore it because in their storyline like obviously tori wants to become like a championship rider and you would think they'd have a horse but you know maybe she just realized that that's what she wanted to do um later on so let's just pretend that's the case but she kind of wants to follow her mom's footsteps so that's kind of what we're doing doing with this one for their trades i also wanted to explore the new trades that came with the pack so frank is a rancher a horse lover and family oriented while tori is a horse lover active and also family oriented i kind of debated with myself on whether to give them like more trades than this like give them more variety or something but i feel like it would just make sense for them to be like horse lovers and ranchers i don't even know what ranchers does like i didn't give it to tori just because i feel like it has to do more with like sheep and stuff i don't know maybe nectar making so i didn't really give her that but i gave her the active trait just because i feel like it will make sense for her to be active because horse riding is a sport so yeah i don't even know if horse riding actually improves your fitness skill as well i mean it should like technically because i feel like in real life it would affect your fitness but i don't know because i think there's a horse riding skill if i'm not mistaken so i feel like it would just make sense for her skill for her like fitness skill to improve as well as her horse riding skill but knowing the sims it's probably not gonna happen but 
、uh, I don't know. Let's see, because I haven't really played with it yet. So anyway, going back to Tori over here, as you can see, like I struggled a bit with her features. I don't know why, but basically, I made her with like the DNA thing, like the genes thing. So I made the dad first, and then I sort of made her from her dad's genes. And initially, like I didn't really like how she turned out, so I had to change some of her features. And then I have a couple of sliders, so I found it kind of hard to like change up some stuff because I haven't really memorized all of the positions of the sliders. So I kind of struggled a bit with that, but I ended up really liking her face. Actually, like I think she looks really pretty, and I also made her really fit because, as I said, I feel like it would make sense for a horseback rider to be like super fit. I also gave her some tattoos, as you can see. And I really enjoy this actually because I rarely give my Sims tattoos unless it's part of a challenge or whatever. But I really enjoy this look for her. I feel like it fits the vibe. So some of her outfits are like sleeveless or like her arm is showing through, and I really like that. Added touch. I also really like the cast stuff that came with this pack. So like the clothes and stuff. Obviously, it's all like the same style. So it's all like ranch style. So there's not a lot of variety. Like there's a lot of items. Not a lot of items, but you know, there's a couple of items, and it's all like the same style. So it kind of looks the same, but nonetheless, like I really like the way these look. Also, I really like the hairs. I debated on whether to get、um, this braided one or the one with. Like sort of like the mullet, um, kind of similar to the one in the trailer that we saw, but all in all, I really like the stuff that came with this pack. Um, so I didn't really use a bunch of CC, save for some like skin details and like most of the CCs that I usually use. But for the clothes, I kind of stuck to、um, the stuff from the pack. But as I said, I still did use some CC. So if you want to check them out, you can definitely check out the links below. I'm gonna post them in the description box. So just download them from there. There are a lot of talented CC creators. I haven't really gone on a haul yet. Yet、for some like horse ranch stuff, because a lot of CC creators usually make like additional items for each pack. I don't know how they do that. Again, I really want to get into like CC creation, so let me know if you're interested in a video on that. Actually, because I want to try and create some CC stuff. Maybe you can start with some recoloring, which I think is pretty easy. I don't know. I'm not sure yet, but you know,、um, I kind of want to do that. So let me know if you guys would be interested in that. But with all that being said, I think the video is ending soon. So Stay tuned for the let's play on this. Again, it's probably gonna be a limited series, so yeah, I'm probably gonna post、uh, the first episode in a couple of days. I don't know yet. I really don't want to commit to anything because my schedule has been pretty sporadic recently, and I apologize for that. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please give it a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.